Hey, it's Eric from Dehaven Camera, and today we're going to go over how to set up the DJI Focus Pro LiDAR system correctly to avoid any damage. So the first thing you're going to do is put your handle on your camera. So you need to have the handle when using the LiDAR unless you have a DJI transmission. So we're going to cover it with just the handle today. So we'll put the LiDAR on the camera. Ideal scenarios, you want the LiDAR as close to the center of lens as possible. For this example, we're going to put it up on the top handle for now. We're going to take our motor. We're going to connect it to the lens. First, we're going to take these two USB-C cables. Now, don't use any USB-C cables. They have to be the DJI ones because these are wired differently. So standard USB-C cables do not work. So we're going to take our two USB-C cables. We're going to plug them into the handle here where it says motor and LiDAR. So plug into the motor one, plug in the USB-C, and then plug that directly into the motor. We're going to take the second one and plug it into the LiDAR port. And then that will go into the front port on the LiDAR, not the back port. So it has to go into the front one. We will not connect to any other sources. So no DTAP, no CAN bus, no other power sources, or you can damage the system. So the next thing we'll do is power this on. So we're going to make sure the lights are on the LiDAR and we can hear the fan running. We're going to make sure the lights are on the motor and we'll make sure that the handle is powered up. From here, we're going to swipe to the right. We want to make sure we see an image from the LiDAR. It's very important. If you don't see an image, either black or this says no connection, reboot and try again or try a different cable. So once we have that up, we're going to go into settings and we're going to create a new lens profile. So for this lens, we're going to click add new. We're going to add and set our focal length to 50 millimeter, which is what we're using for this example and step back. Then we're going to start calibration again. So it's going to calibrate the motor. Okay. Once that's done, we'll hit confirm. So we're going to move our camera till it's one meter from an object that we can use as a focus reference. So right now you see that it says one meter. So if I move in closer, it's less than a meter. Move in farther, it says one meter. So we want to be one meter from an object. Right now it's our wall. We're going to use this thumb wheel to make sure that we can find focus. So we're going to use our focus peaking. So now that we found focus, we're going to tap the screen and we're going to step one is now complete. Now we need to move to four meters. So we're going to move further back. Again, we're going to use the wall as our point of reference. We're going to get to four meters and we're going to find focus with the thumb wheel again. And then once we're in focus, we're going to tap the screen again. So now our autofocus is enabled and we should be able to see the focus change as we move in and turn. So we can see that our lens profile is set. So as you can see, we now have an autofocus system based on the LiDAR. So that's the correct way to configure the DJI LiDAR for the Focus Pro with the handle. Make sure that you don't plug in any other USB sources or power this system from any USB ports on your camera. Only use the handle battery or the DJI transmission with the LiDAR connection cable. 